one day after perennial All-Pro Joe Thomas was lost for the season, the NFL's other prospective all-decade left tackle saw his season end. Jason Peters sustained an ACL and MCL tear during the Eagles over the Redskins on Monday Night Football, NFL Network Insider Ian Rapoport reported Tuesday. Philadelphia coach Doug Peterson later confirmed Peters will miss the rest of the season. Peters was fitted for an air cast and carted off the field after his lower leg was pinned under the body of Redskins defensive tackle Ziggy Hood early in the third quarter. He was immediately ruled out for the remainder of the game with a knee injury. Peters' teammates swarmed the card and gave him an emotional send-off, a nod to the severity of the knee injury and the respect with which the nine-time pro bowler is held in Philadelphia. A 166-game starter across 14 NFL seasons, Peters had been playing at a high level through six-and-a-half games, keying one of the league's most effective offensive lines. Peters' value to a Super Bowl contender cannot be overstated. After struggling as a stand-in for right tackle Lane Johnson in extended action last season, Halapolovati Vitae will now be charged with protecting the blind side of emerging MVP candidate Carson Wentz. Doug Peterson said team still talking about who will be their new left tackle. Early educated hunches Lane Johnson stays on the right, a Mike Garofalo at Mike Garofalo October 24, 2017 In addition to Peters, linebacker Jordan Hicks suffered an ankle injury in the first half and DIDNT return. Peterson told reporters Tuesday that Hicks will miss the rest of the season with an Achilles injury.